is just up and back, right hand, left hand, slide protection and tempo changes. With slide protection, we teach one basic thing. Toes pointed straight ahead. We want to get a good push. Synchronize the ball on your foot. So it's push, push, push. Same thing coming back. Okay. Push, push, push. All right, trying to get that power leg with the slide protection. Alright, so for our ball handling, we're going to take you through three basic things. A stutter step, a hesitation, an in and out, and then a combo. So first is our hesitation. The way we teach it is to touch and explode. Okay, so as you're dribbling, it's going to be touch and explode. Okay, dribble, touch, explode. Right or left, same thing. Alright, dribble, touch, explode right there. So it's just a change of pace, it's a hesitation. Okay, with our stutter step, we exaggerate uh, about two seconds, so I'm dribbling. Uh, here, and then explode. We teach it in two ways. We teach a cross step, so I get my stutter step, and then a cross hard, right to the body, uh, and we do a stutter step with an open step. Same hand, same foot, explosion leg. Okay? Right, right side, left side. And the last one is a in and out. We use just a line on the floor. I want you all the way on the right side. You can exaggerate your dribble. In, out, gather. In, out, gather. In, out, gather. More advanced, we're going to pick up the footwork. So it's going to be in, out, gather, in, out, gather, in, out, gather. Okay, want to get that exaggerated. Pull with the pinky, push with the thumb, pound the ball. That's in and out. All right, this is our finish series. So we're going to go a floater first off one foot, trying to use the backboard. So right hand, strong hand, left hand, weak hand, or vice versa, whatever you are. Uh, we call this a power finish. We teach two things, sideline skinny and baseline big. Okay, sideline skinny is skinny to the sideline, baseline big is big to the baseline. So that's key terminology we use to try to make it stick. Sideline skinny, baseline big, we work everything off a cross step. So here's what it looks like. I'm gonna square up, triple threat, take my foot across, and pound, pop, and pop. Step them off, step them across, power, step off, create space. Uh, this is a pull-up floater, so again, we use sideline skinny, baseline big, and, and a one-two footing. So, if I'm coming right, I'm going to go right-left and up. If I'm coming left, I'm going to go left-right and up. Okay, so I'm just trying to get through a gap here, and then the body turns right there. So this is pull-up floater. Taking on the dribble, maybe coming off the screen here, a one-two, and up. 45. Coming left, coming here, left-right. All right, this is a one-two pull-up, so we're going to take two dribbles. The footing is one-two, one-two, so two steps, and then one-two to finish. All right, we're going to go all right side, and then all left side. All right, this is our last shooting drill. This is going to be a, a step, a cross, and a pull. Okay, coming from both ways, so if I'm coming to my right, I'm going to jab, cross, Dribble, get into my steps, okay? Dribble cross step is what we call it. All right, this last drill is our finisher. It's one of our favorite drills. It's called three, two, one. You're going to catch it, shoot it. That's a three. Off a dribble is two. To the rack is one. So there's six total points for each round. We go four quarters with our young guys, five with our older guys. High school, college, we go seven, eight rounds. So depending on how many rounds you're doing, we're only going to go four rounds today for a total of 24 points. So 3-2-1, 3-2-1, 3-2-1, 3-2-1. All right, here we go. 45. 47. 